what is case study? See, understand, case study is not simply an example. There is a difference in what you write in your GS answers and how you write your geography optional answers or any optional answers. In GS answers, so suppose there's a question on coral bleaching in your geography optional and there's a question on coral bleaching in your GS answer. A difference here. There are two, three differences. One difference is how far are you able to use the keywords? So what I'm trying to say here is if coral bleaching is there in your GS. This has been asked, I guess, in 2019 in your GS paper one. Uh, and coral bleaching has been asked in your geography optional also. So don't know my difference care. While you are writing GS answers, firstly, you will not use the technical terms. Okay, like specific terms, okay, uh, Clive Wilkinson report, ne ye, ye, ye boli thi. it is not as required, but it is required in your geography optional paper. You will have to use keywords. So when it is about coral bleaching, you can use terms like limits to growth, okay, ki excessive pollution and uh, there, the Beyond carrying capacity, hum pollution karte hai, to aapki coral bleaching hoti hai. So you are putting certain key terms which you've studied in various places. You study uh, limits to growth, you study carrying capacity, you study about the technocentric view of development. If you would have studied in perspective, uh, there is a topic called as man-environment relations, wherein uh, the debate is, abhi, some of you can relate, those who are studying perspective, in man-environment relation, who has to be given more superiority in the man-environment relation? Basically, if the way we are having a development, this technocentric view of development, it says that man can control every type of environmental thing and has upper limit with respect to environment. But another type of man-environment relation and the type of development is ecocentric form of development. One is technocentric, where man has superiority. Hai. Dusra hai ecocentric form of development wherein we respect the carrying capacity of the environment. We actually consider uh, your earth as mother goddess, Gaia. So Gaianism, jo hota hai, deep ecology, jo hota hai, uh, when they say ki if you go for development beyond carrying capacity, the earth will revert back. Ek quote suna hoga, nature protect if it is protected. So Uttarakhand mein landslides, hona, GLOF, hona. Uh, it is not just because of natural factors. It is because man has done development beyond the carrying capacity. So jo shanty towns, hai, hostels, hai, hotels hai, in as eco-sensitive area as your hilly region. So this is a debate. So this you cannot write in your GS answers. But subtle use of terms like technocentric form of development, uh, development beyond the carrying capacity, uh, limits to growth. If you have terms in your answers mein aate hai, geography optional, mein, that means it shows that you are able to use the terms that you study at across one place. So how do you make your answer geographical is one, uh, you use the key terms. What I'm trying to discuss here is if coral bleaching question is asked in GS, how is it different from your geography option? So, first, you use keywords. Use karenge. Keywords are the one we discussed now. The second is uh, your case study. Okay. You use a case study and you there's a separate paragraph. There's a separate box which has a place and cert certain detailed information. That is what you call as case study. So, case study is not simply an example. So, for example, I'm writing about coral bleaching in GS. So, let's say one reason for coral bleaching is global warming. The other reason for bleaching is high nutrients and enrichment. This I'm writing in GS. And simply an example. Example, Red Sea. Example, Great Barrier Reef. This much amount of nutrient enrichment. You have an example in a line. This is not the same as a case study. So case study is not an example per se. It is not a one-liner example. So what is a case study? Basically, in a case study, ek pehle box so that you highlight that you are writing a case study. You also write the word case study. When you write a case study, there are a few things that should be there. One is, it is about an example in not one line, but at least three to four lines. Three to four lines, you aap ek example ko substantiate kar rahe. Matlab, aap us pe gaye. For example, if I have to write a case study on coral bleaching, how do I write as a geographer? I went to that place. Uh, called as Great Barrier Reef, I saw this percentage of the uh, barrier, uh, reef has been bleached. I linked to certain reasons, like one, two, three reasons. And I also write ki kuch initiative liya tha. Uh, let's say coral reef initiatives, uh, your coral reef monitoring, and the other things. So what I'm doing is I'm not writing one example in one line. I'm trying to go to that place. I'm trying to give a fact ki itna percent bleaching hua. 
इस इस कारण के कारण ब्लीचिंग हुआ एंड ये ये स्टेप्स लिए थे एंड इफ इट इज पॉसिबल यू ऑल्सो शो द प्लेस विच यू आर रेफरिंग इन योर केस स्टडी सो वॉट इज अ केस स्टडी बेसिकली इट्स लाइक यू आर स्टडिंग अ केस विच केस अ जोग्राफिकल केस Why are you studying? Because you have some specialization. That's what is your geographical optional answer versus a GS answer. GS में आप सिर्फ एक line लिख के आओ. But in geography, better than writing five, seven, six dimension. Even if you write four dimension with substantiated details and good diagrams, that is more than enough, right? So this is what differentiates uh, from GS versus your geography optional answers. One is use of key terms. The other is your case studies. and third thing that is especially done for your geography optional answers in gs should i use case study if you use it's good even if you don't use it you will not be penalized for that theek hai and gs mein bahut sare sub parts aa jate hain they ask you two three sub parts i guess abhi international relation wala question tha bimstek and sark wala in 10 marker they asked four parts the similarity differences are they parallel organization what can they do so many sub parts are asked in your gs therefore even if you don't mention case study you not be penalized for that but for geography optional it is advantages for yourself that you write your case study so one is you use your key terms second you use case studies and how do you use case study wohi repurpose karna chahiye thus case study banana ek environment pollution pe ek urban pollution pe heat dome pe wohi delhi pe bhi chipkana new york mein bhi chipkana and use it across the places so have some uh, ground water exploitation and the other surface water exploitation over exploitation can be used as case studies so pick up 10 15 themes from your paper use that case studies and uh, make 10 to 15 themes and then try to use them across the uh, places one second uh, the third thing that actually you need to write for your geography optional paper is uh, the regional analysis it uh, how should i write an example of coral bleaching should i write my example as 1 2 3 4 are the causes or should i actually give the regional analysis as in if they are asking state the causes for coral bleaching almost uh, 70 to 80% of you will write as per themes global warming nutrient enrichment etc 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 but in case a student writes as a regional analysis as in australia mein uh, this was the reason रेड सी में दिस वॉज द रीजन पैसिफिक ओशन में दिस वॉज द रीजन वट हैपन्स इज ऑर्गेनाइजेशन इज डिफरेंट फ्रॉम रेस्ट ऑफ द अदर्स एंड ही हैज गिवन अ रीजनल एनालिसिस एंड दिस रीजनल एनालिसिस इज बेसिकली योर टूल इफ यू आर स्टक एट एनी क्वेश्चन लेट से रीजनल डिस्पैरिटीज इन इंडिया इफ यू आर स्टक देन ट्राई टू point out what would be the problems in northeast what would be the problem in the northwest of the part of the country uh, the southern part of the country uh, the hilly region the tribal areas the island regions so what is happening is if you are stuck at any place in your optional answers try to go for regional analysis the moment you go for regional analysis automatically aapke points aa jate hain क्योंकि नॉर्थ ईस्ट में ये प्रॉब्लम्स है इसलिए रीजनल डेवलपमेंट नहीं है हिली एरियाज में ये प्रॉब्लम्स है इसलिए रीजनल डेवलपमेंट नहीं है ट्राइबल एरियाज में ये प्रॉब्लम्स है सो आई एम नॉट लुकिंग फॉर द कॉजेज ऑफ रीजनल इम्बेलेंसेज बेसिकली आई एम गोइंग स्पेशली एंड दिस इज मोर एप्लीकेबल फॉर योर जोग्राफी ऑप्शन पेपर बिकॉज वॉट इज जोग्राफी जोग्राफी इज नथिंग बट योर स्टडी ऑफ प्लेसेज सो स्पेशल एनालिसिस either in the form of a case study what are you doing giving a special example either in the form of your organization of the answer so you can uh, differentiate your answer writing from the uh, gs answer uh, writing